Hello, uh, my name is Chien and today in this video I'm going to show you how to handle and resolve the issue with the Internet Information Services on the Windows 10 PC. Okay, so currently I already installed the, the IS Express on this PC and also turn on the all of the feature for information for internet information services on this PC. However, when I open the browser and type the local host uh, over the URL, but nothing display here. You can see when I enter I enter is it displays the blank screen here. I mean in currently the local host and IS still not work on this PC so now how can we resolve it okay so let's close this control panel first and I will open the inf internet information service manager I will open the window run at is INET manager You can see here on the right side, under the action menu, we have the option to get new web platform component here. Just click on it. And by default, if you still not install the web platform installer uh, on the PC, it will direct you to this website. You click on the download button here to get the file to the PC, and after that you install it. And once the installation is done, uh, and you will, when you click to the get new web platform component again, it will display this screen. Okay, so now you type it URL. You can see on the top top records we have URL try to point zero. You click on the add button here. Click on the install. I accept. And wait until the installation is done. And basically, when you just install the IS on on Windows 10, by default, is and you type the localhost on the Browser by default is does not support for rezone the URL. So meaning um, uh, when you type the URL, it does not find the root path of the folder to display the the content on the web page. So we have to install the URL to rewrite 2.0 here to rezone that issue. Hit the finish button as it and now come back to the browser here. You refresh this one here. After that, you can see this one is the default page of information internet information services on uh, after you install the IS successfully on the PC. Okay, so I hope this video will be helpful for you and let me know if you have another issue.